You do not get away with that very often. Oh, I nearly kept the nose up. All right, good morning. It is about 7.15 in the morning. And I'm just walking into town to meet the tandem guys. They're gonna give me a ride up so I can go and practice some fly on the wall landings. It's not something I'm too familiar with. I've landed uphill with tailwinds before, but never sort of steep fly on the wall landings, I guess. So the plan today is, uh, it's not really a cross country day. We've got a lot of rain forecast actually to come through. So make use of the non cross country days and uh, practice some stuff that I need to do for my tandem exam. So my tandem exam, which is coming up in a couple of weeks. I need to do some fly on the wall landings. So make use of today. So we're not really going to be planning any tasks or going anywhere. As I say, it's going to be a bit of rain. And uh, yeah, see if we can do some fly on the wall landings. Right, so that's the tandem off. Uh, I've got my solo rigged, so we're going to take this one for a hoon now. For flying the walls, there's a couple of opportunities uh, on the way down here. I think you can do it up to eight. If you get all the paddocks lined up at the right time, you can do up to eight flying the walls on the way down, so that's good practice. But I've got my eye on two. One of them, I'm not sure if I'm going to have enough height to get to from here. It's similar height to the takeoff, so I need to take off quickly, hook a right, and we're going to go around the back of these trees, and there's another takeoff just around there so I'll aim for that one first if it looks good I'll go for it if it doesn't I can turn away and it sort of gets a nervous one out of the way to start with and then further down uh, there's there's a real steep one with the road runs along the top which is plenty wide enough so I sort of be able to gauge my height a little bit better flying along the tree lines I've told you, you need to skim the bushes on the way in don't take too much speed in I don't need to be doing 100 k's an hour but um, obviously I need to keep enough speed on for doing a fly on the wall so um, I'll head down to the one that's uh, at the bottom of the road. I think Toby's down there as well watching, so I've got a bit of an audience. We'll see how it goes. But um, yeah, for now, we'll, uh, we'll go and practice a fly on the wall landings. And yes, if I mess up on my first one, I will put it in the video. Don't worry. Now, a quick description of what the fly on the wall landing is, if you're not sure. So a normal hang glider landing, you'll be coming down, you'd approach the ground, skim along the ground a bit, flare and then stop. Now, a fly on the wall landing, you're actually gonna be flying towards a hillside and you're gonna be landing up the slope. So you'll dive at the hill and at the last moment, you'll turn the extra speed into a flare and you should come to a stop and land on the hill. All right, let's keep these down tubes straight. All right, this beautiful breeze blowing up. Let's do it. Don't zip the harness up. <laughs> I'll need the legs out pronto. So it's there. It looks good. <laughs> yes! Oh, <laughs> I caught the rear wire. I don't want to do that again. Oh, what a rush. <laughs> what a rush. That was cool, I just need to make a phone call. Yo, yeah, did it. Yep, yeah, they're both still straight. Yeah, still alive. Yeah, I didn't think so either. But um, yeah, science actually, yeah, it worked. I'm gonna go and do another one now. Hopefully that goes as well. All right, see you bro, cheers, bye. A little bit crossed down at the moment, so I'm just waiting for it to blow up. And then once we back off, I'm back turning over to the right. We're gonna go over towards Lugi Brugli. There's another opportunity over there. This is steep, very steep. Steep's good for taking off in light wind though. I need to head around this corner. I think the paddocks are just down here. Where on earth are they? There it is. 
But it's a paddock's just in front, just below the road. There's two there, and he's coming close to the bush line. That's just on the downward slope. And uh, yeah, point it up towards the road. So hopefully this one goes just as good as the first one. Hopefully it goes better in the fact that I don't go for the rear wire first. All right, let me go on the other side now. Oh, I think I'm too low. Now I'm not gonna come through those trees. <laughs> it's quite fun when you get it right. And I walk up there now. That first one was sweet. It's 95% in the head, isn't it? This is what John Smith said. He said the slope landing like this is easier than a Millwind flat landing. I believe it. Yep. All right, I'll see you down there. Tree line coming up. <laughs> Straight over, look at this. Cool. Beautiful thing with these morning flights is you get you get to do this. Wow. Well, all that fun. It's not even nine o'clock yet. So we're going to get a couple more slope landings in in a couple of different locations. Peter's up here this time as well. He's going to show me a couple of others on the way down. But we're up at the whole old takeoff again, which is a shallow one. Um, it's not as sinister as it looks. Oh, it's, okay. um, it's there just trying to stay dry. So we've just had a little bit of rain passing through now. And the last thing I want on this shallow takeoff is any water on the wing at all. Because it's um, just a little amount of water on the wing on this takeoff will definitely come into effect because it's pretty shallow. Right, it's blowing up. Yes, here comes the breeze. That is a good breeze. That's 60 degrees off, which is a no-go. I know that, I don't, I know. I don't need to chance that. I know that's not far enough off. That's straight. <laughs> yes. Holy shit. Holy shit, you do not, you do not get away with that very often. Right, that's my one of the season. I'm not doing that again. Not surprising, eh? I'm gonna get around this cloud. It's this much smoother down here now. Okay, it's lining up. Yep, I'm happy with that. It's lining up. <laughs> oh, I nearly kept my nose up. I bloody dropped you. Sorry about that. That's better. bit further would have been nice. Oh, I know my hiking, please. 
All right, this time, let's finish today on a high. We're gonna get that spot. All right, spot nine. Come on, spot. Oh, we're gonna be well short, are we? <laughs> Does that count? <laughs>